guys and gals, wizards of all ages. I'm Allura Rainhaven, and I am calling all wizards. Long time no see you guys. Um, I haven't made a video on this channel in a really long time, and I recently found just an absolutely great route for getting a lot of different kinds of reagents. So I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, so let me uh, get started here by showing you where I am. Now, this may be a little bit difficult for some of you lower level characters if you haven't gotten to um, Winter Tusk. But if you really want to uh, get this route, you can try to find me. Um, I, again, I'm Allura Rainhaven in the game, and I will help you get here if you are too low level and you can't get there on your own. But where I am, you guys, is I am in Grizzleheim, and this is in Winter Tusk. And then from Winter Tusk, you go to Vesterland. So um, where I am in Vesterland, where I start my my route, is actually almost dead center. Um, of the map here. You'll see this little, I guess it's kind of like a little tower here, and that's where I always start this, um, this little route that I have here. And the reagents you can get with this route is Black Lotus, um, with the possibility of Black Pearl, Frost Flower with the possibility of Grindelweed, Mistwood with the possibility of acorn, deep mushroom with the possibility of nightshade, and ore with the possibility of diamond. So um, let's get started and I will um, go ahead and change realms here to begin. And let's just go backwards alphabetically here. Okay. Um, where I start at, again, is right in the middle here of Vesterland, and there's typically three, wow, look at there, Black Pearl, there's typically three Black Lotus here, and you do have to be careful with these Winter Branch um, Ice Skies there, uh, they do uh, black Lotus do kind of tend to spawn a little close to their path, but as long as you don't go beyond this line here, this little, where this wall is, you should be fine. So I get three Black Lotus, and sometimes there's only one or two, but usually there's three that spawn there. And once I get those, we turn around, and the teleport hub is here. Now, sometimes you will see a silver chest either over here near this cave or behind the teleport hub. Um, I don't always, well, usually I don't get the uh, silver chest because it just takes too long. And when I'm farming, I want to get the reagents as quickly as I possibly can so that I can craft whatever it is I'm trying to make. So I don't usually get the silver chest, but you can if you'd like. It's usually over there or behind the teleport hub or in other places I'll show you. Now we will port back here to the main entrance. So once we've ported here, um, you can always go back here and see if the silver chest is back here. I'm of course not going to get it. But once you've ported here, you're going to want to go out this door. There's I think two, just two doors, so it's going to be this one on the uh, left hand side, and you're going to go straight. And once you go straight, we're going to be getting our frost flowers over here, and that's the teleport hub. But we're not going to use it. We're going to get the frost flowers. And then we're going to continue on around. Now, sometimes the frost flower will spawn 
right next to the teleport hub back there you guys so be really careful to not hit the teleport hub rather than um, getting the frost flower so our next reagents are going to be the mistwood there's two um, usually there's two am I missing it let's see huh well Oh, there it is. I guess it was right under my nose. So after you get the two mist wood, you're going to keep going around and past the wheelbarrow. Make sure you go down this ramp. Otherwise, if you keep going straight and you're up on that top level, you're just going to have to turn back around. So we're going to go down this way and we're going to pass the ice arc. And then we're going to get our two deep mushrooms and there's wow look at that getting really good uh, drops here you guys there's <clears throat> there's always two of those as well and then we're gonna go across the bridge sometimes there will be a um, silver chest up here or a wooden chest up here and then we're going to have two or spawn over here well oh here we go <laughs> wow look at that diamond <clears throat> yeah you gotta make sure that you're not too close to that cave there when it spawns there or it's going to get confused about what you're trying to do so then we're just going to come past the uh, teleport hub we used earlier and we'll go right back here and we're ready to change realms again <coughs> <coughs> I'm so sorry you guys if I'm coughing and I'm hoarse um, it is uh, it's just turning cold outside where I live it's actually Halloween tomorrow and um, look at that Wow just getting crazy crazy awesome drops here with these reagents it's just ridiculous look at that look at that that is awesome anyways it's uh, Halloween tomorrow here I think and um, there's the wooden chest it's Halloween here and it's just starting to get a little cold outside and so my throat is just scratchy and I'm so hoarse and I'm so sorry you guys I hate the sound of my own voice as it is um, I, if you can't tell <laughs> like you couldn't like you wouldn't be able to tell but um, I live in the southern United States I, I actually live in Alabama and was born and raised here and so I have a very thick southern draw and um, it's very noticeable and I really don't like it because most people think that um, that southern people are or dumb or uneducated and uh, even though I've got even though I got my um, <clears throat> my college degree at the age of 18 two years earlier than most people usually do in the United States still just because of my accent people would think that I'm dumb so <laughs> I usually hate the sound of my own voice already as it is because of that and um, to add the scratchy hoarseness on top of it it's just horrible I may not even use my voice over at all I don't know okay you guys well I think you guys pretty much got the point um, it's a really really great route I think 
route, route, depending on where you live, how you say it. Um, so I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like this and you want to see more of this or you want to see something else, please let me know and I will do my very best to um, make some more videos for you guys especially with reagents and where to find them. I really enjoy farming um, in the game, so uh, I've made a haul of tapestries with my lower level character, and um, because I've made like this haul of tapestries, I'm trying to make every tapestry in the game, and you can imagine what type of um, reagents that's, you know, costing me. <laughs> So, uh, getting these, finding these really great farming routes are just extremely helpful. So, anyways, um, alright you guys, well I will see you in the next video. Laura Rainhaven out.